quill. Yeah. Hope. Sits up and saved. I'm not a fan of them hater types. In these bars, I spread his message like some paper kites. Because we imprisoned and killed for his righteousness. I might just go out and build a church in front of ISIS. And scream at the top of my lungs, we're made in his likeness. It's no surprise that many men will scrutinize that we're moving. They throw shade, I bet it ricochet. I penetrate them all with the sword, their mouths full of hate. Grapevine stalk, leaving beef on my dinner plate. Steak knife open to cut it off. How you guys doing? It's Marcus Mayweather. You are tuned in to H12.TV where we discuss real life, bring you real knowledge, and point to real hope. So I wanted to take the temptations of a young Christian and personify them to put them in a first person perspective. So this is what you get. Gotta get my kick up, cause on me I'm so sick of struggling And I'm not complaining, but at times I feel I work for nothing Sometimes my body hurting, it's got me thinking this ain't worth it Lord, will this pay off? And I call on you to give me comfort And I'm not gonna trip though, cause I know that I got blessings coming And I sit up late at night and wonder how you kept me going Think about all the times when you stepped in and kept me from falling But please forgive me if I miss the ring when you be calling But the clock won't stop ticking, time is something so beyond us And we never will stop a minute, we just keep our sights set upon these dollars I done came up out the trenches, rose from the mud all bruised and scarred And I know we got a plan for me, so everything I've been through made me stronger Like you have to, you know, if you want positive results If you want to be positive, stop making excuses about all your negative stuff and stop associating with negative people you know and, and and you know but don't 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 get it twisted the devil can disguise himself as an angel of light and and and, and pose it as a as a positive figure in your life until like last minute and then it's like well, here's this contract now, you know what I'm saying? Like anything, you know, a car salesman is pretty positive until it's time to, you know, get down to business and his whole vibes change. And he's like, well, we, we we can set you up. The deal sounds so sweet. And then you figure out like, you know, four years later, you paid eight more grand than you should have because in that four years, that brand new car that you couldn't afford went down in value by like $4,000. But, you, you know, you don't think about that stuff. So that car salesman, you know, at first, you know what I'm saying? And then, then, then you know, you dun, dun, you know what I'm saying? Like, then, then it's just, that, that's where prayer comes in for discernment. You know what I'm saying? Because discernment, that will be able to tell so basically the good thing from the best thing. God wants the best for you.